The crankcase is the largest component in the engine. Although it weighs tons, it still has to be precision machined to within hundreds of a millimeter. This is what the raw component looks like when it arrives from the foundry. It takes seven separate clamping operations in three machining centers to transform the raw casting into a finished crankcase. The machining process is fully automated. The surfaces of the component are milled away under a deluge of cooling lubricant fluid. Each crankcase sheds around 300 kilograms of swarf during the machining process. Technicians fit the bearing caps between the various clamping operations. The deep boring spindle drills out the passages for the crankshaft and camshafts, a process which demands the utmost precision. Tolerances for the crankshaft and camshaft bearings allow for a divergence of only 0.02 mm between the axes. The machining centers are computer-controlled high-tech units. Although tools are changed automatically, crankcase production still relies on manual skills. Technicians smooth out uneven surfaces during deburring. Dirt and chips are removed during the subsequent washing process. A gauging machine is used to ensure that all of the bore diameters are correct. Just before the end of the manufacturing process, technicians subject each crankcase to a thorough inspection, searching for chips and other debris. Before the crankcases are packed, plugs are fitted in the oil and water channels. Packed and protected against corrosion, the crankcases are stored for only a few days before they are transferred to the assembly section to be fitted in a Series 4000 engine.